Welcome back, Canada, the world, anyone watching. <laughs> we have our pairs here. We're at the Canadian Tire National Skating Championships 2020, and the senior pairs event just ended so beautifully. Oh. Um, we got number one and number two with us, Kirsten and Michael, who just won the championship <laughs> again. And uh, Canadian record? I think so. And yeah. <laughs> party and a Canadian record we got Trent and Evelyn who just gave such a beautiful performance the crowd just erupted they've woke up so you guys woke, woke them up yeah. Yeah. you guys woke them up for you guys set them up yeah. for yeah. the whole thing yeah. you know um, first of all congratulations to both of you guys uh, first I want to say it seems like you guys got some going that is really cool and really special uh, how does it feel training uh, with each other you know you guys are number one and number two but you're also teammates and really good friends Kirsten why don't you start telling us the story? <laughs> yeah, it's amazing. Uh, we're new training mates this season, and uh, we work with their coach now, Alison Ferkus, who's made a world of difference for us, along with Bruno, of course. And we know what they're capable of, and we're so excited to, to see them lay it down. We know that they deserve it. And it was a little bit tricky for us to hear that they were in first place when we had to go and deliver our own performance. Uh, but we're, we couldn't be more thrilled for them and for our team. Yeah, I definitely uh, took a second to have to reset after we heard... Uh, Charlie and Lubov score and that they were in first place. We were pretty pumped for them, but I had to bring it back in and focus on ourselves, which was difficult. I had to do in about 30 seconds, but right. luck <laughs> luckily we did and we, we brought it back together. It took me a little longer and <laughs> we did it. Yeah, and you know, like you said, you made a small mistake at the beginning, but I was sitting there watching and the fact that you were be, you were able to pull those double toe, double toes after a single sow, I don't know how you did that. That was yeah. that was that's that's hard to do, yeah, honestly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's harder to do than triple double double uh, yeah. if you guys don't know it's it's pretty difficult to do would so not recommend, <laughs> <laughs> would not recommend but but that's a, you know that's the warrior that you are and it was absolutely amazing to watch and for you guys how did it feel out there you just you know uh, I was sitting there with my sisters and we were like these two are in complete sync like it was so amazing to watch that everything you guys did every step was not only on the music but in complete sync with each other um, uh, I mean how did you how did it feel you know being out there mm -hmm. well we kind of went into it from the short as the underdog and I think um, we just kind of fed off each other and used each other for that energy. We had nothing to lose out there, so we um, just tried to do what we did in training and deliver. Yeah, for sure. The whole point of our was skate to one, so we're just trying to be one with each other and uh, <laughs> just trying to show yeah, I know. <laughs> just trying to show show that off. But it makes it a lot easier when it's we're working together as a team out there. It's so much easier uh, with Evelyn than it is just skating by yourself. Yes. Yeah, I'm sure. And you know, you guys have that kind of support, um, and I think that both of you guys being able to be together and train together is absolutely amazing and you guys had you know you welcomed a new team into your home um, how was that uh, at the beginning um, I mean, yeah. you guys are already really good friends but we want the truth here <laughs> Canada we're getting the truth the real scoop right here honestly we loved it though because yeah. um, we train with junior and novice teams um, no other senior teams so it is sometimes hard each day to get motivated um, but they only raise that bar for us and we envy a lot of things they do so um, I think it's only pushed us and helped yeah I think we just pushed each other in a healthy way you know we both want the best for each other and then we just kind of keep pushing each other like uh, raising the bar each day in training and then I got to cook Mike dinner at home every <laughs> night make sure he's fed well but Friend, literally well <laughs> <laughs> no, no, number one housewife right here <laughs> um, I think this is so beautiful to see I'm so happy for you guys uh, you guys deserve it it's 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 a uh, it's a friendship that I think is gonna keep growing throughout the years uh, uh, and a partnership uh, the four of you guys I think are going to do some amazing things in uh, in the future now um, you know you guys again Canadian record uh, it's awesome you're setting yourselves up uh, you know to, to come to worlds to compete with uh, the top dogs what is uh, what is the strategy uh, for the next uh, couple months for you guys uh, we're just gonna have to keep uh, pushing the performance pushing the program we were a little bit tight and slow out there uh, competing on uh, world ice we're definitely gonna have to bring a much bigger bigger skate and bigger performance than uh, we did this weekend but we're definitely on path and that was better than what we've been doing this season so we're we're going in the right direction yeah 
though this was better than our previous performances in competition, though not better than training. Yeah. So we still have some work to do. I think there are a variety of factors at competition that affect the way you get the job done. Sometimes they help you, sometimes it's a bit of a hindrance. So um, we're going to have to learn how to deal with that. I mean, Mike killed it this weekend. I had a few troubles, um, which was a little bit uncharacteristic for me and a little bit of a head scratcher. So, I mean, just go back to work and make sure it doesn't happen again. Absolutely. And I'm going to crush it at Worlds. Yeah. Oh, yeah, they will. And I want to say that, Mike, uh, you know, this year we've talked about, you know, you've never jumped so well, I think, in your entire career. But today in this performance, even yesterday in those two performances, you just nailed uh, the jumps uh, better than I've ever seen you do. So congratulations Thank for that, man. Much. Yeah. Woo. Woo. Give it up for Mike. Give it up for Mike. <laughs> um, but yeah, so congratulations, guys. I'm so happy. This is so beautiful to see. And uh, you guys deserve uh, all the good. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. Um, this was absolutely incredible. One of my favorite events, I think, of the of the of the of the week. So thank you guys. Stay tuned. Uh, men's event coming up.